everybody and welcome back to my channel. Um, this is horrible lighting. I know I'm in a parking structure right now, so ignore that. But I am going to the Love Simon sneak peek in um, in West Westfield Century City Mall. I think is what it's called. Um, I am running late in typical Kevin fashion. My shoes keep um, loosening themselves, but I uh, got a ticket because I'm friends with um, Becky Albertoli, the author of the book that it's based off of is one of my best friends. She asked me if I wanted to come and I was like, of course. I think the cast is gonna be there tonight. I don't know what's going on. I'm running late though. I've never been to this mall, it's huge. So I need to hurry up and get up there. Ugh, the red carpet already started. So I need to hurry and uh, I will see you guys upstairs because it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be a great movie. I'm gonna cry, but we'll be back. <laughs> carpet over there somewhere. I just left the movie and I cried maybe about five times and I'm not even exaggerating when I say I cried five times. I can't even find this. Ugh, I'm a really sweaty um, though. It's a little hot and uh, I need to get out of this parking garage because I'm paying for parking and it's crazy because it's where we're at. So I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to go pick up some chicken nuggets because I really want chicken nuggets and it's, um, I'm not going to 
yeah, I'm gonna go get some chicken nuggets. And then um, I will see you guys when I'm back at home. I can't believe everything. Oh, I cried so many times. I cried five times. Okay, we'll come back. I'll be back when I'm home with chicken nuggets. Look what I see on the way home. It's a Simon poster. Ugh. Oh, perfect movie. Go see it. Ugh. Okay. Ugh. Ugh. Simon. I'm getting my chicken nuggets. Bah, chicken nuts! Uh, why is it taking so long? Uh. All right, I'm finally home, and oh, this lighting is bad. <clears throat> I'm finally home, and so just a quick recap of the night. Um, so I got to go because I am friends with Becky Albertalli, who is the writer of Simon vs. the Homo Sapiens Agenda, because uh, which is what Live Simon is based off of. So she's the reason why I got to go. And then um, while I was there, like waiting in the VIP area, I saw Trevor Moran. Um, who else I see? Uh, Jordan Rodriguez, who played Christian in uh, Dance Academy. I don't know if you've ever watched that. If you haven't, it's a great show on Netflix. You should totally watch it. I stood next to him for a while and I was like, oh, that's, that's, that's Christian from Dance Academy. Do I say something? But I didn't say anything. I didn't say anything to anyone because I am a chicken. But that's, that's besides the point. So... After the movie, Becky introduced me to uh, George Lonberg Jr., I think is how you pronounce his name. He plays Nick in the movie. Um, he's also in Spider-Man, Homecoming, stuff like that. Uh, oh, he was so nice. He was very nice. And then I met Greg Berlin. Ber I can never pronounce his name. Gre let me let me look up how to pronounce it. Okay, I still don't know how to pronounce it. Greg Berlanti, I think. Berlanti. I met him. He's the director. He also directed Dustin's Creek. He also directs Riverdale. I mean, he was super nice. And I also met his husband, Robbie Rogers, who I've always had a huge crush on. And I got to shake his hand and I didn't pass out. But I totally thought I was going to pass out. Becky was like, you want me to introduce you? And I was like, you want me to pass out? So I basically almost passed out. I also saw like Nick Robinson, like basically, you know, who you'd think would be there. I saw. Um, it was a great 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 movie like you should go see it. it comes out friday which i think is when this is going up um so if this is up it comes out tonight um probably um yes i wore a dinosaur shirt underneath my button up don't judge it's just such a great movie um it needs to be watched by everyone i cried like five times it like just represented like gay teens in a way that i think like movies have never done before and um it just uh, it was just so good. I don't even know how to put into words. Like, the book has always meant, excuse me, the book has always meant so much to me. And so seeing it made into a movie was just so weird and amazing and I loved it. Go see it. Go see it. It was a great movie. I love Becky. I love the movie. It was just, oh, oh my God. I can't even say how many times. I can't just keep saying I loved it because it would get, this video would be just be, just be mean of being annoying. And so <laughs> instead of doing that, we're gonna go ahead and end the video here. Um, if you haven't seen it, if this goes up for some reason late and you haven't, and it's been out and you haven't seen it, it comes out, um, today is the um, 13th, so 14th, 15th, I think 16th, uh, March 16th, 2018. If for some reason this goes up past that, or if it comes up, if it goes up on the day of, go see Love, Simon. It is so good. You will cry and you will love it. And it's just like, oh, I want to go see it again already. I'm probably going to go see it again this weekend. Oh, I have to work this weekend. I'm going to go see it whenever I can. It's so good. I will go see it a million more times if I can. <sighs> go see it. Go see Love, Simon and love it. Because I love it and I love Simon. I love movie Simon. I love book Simon. I love Simon. <sighs> I love his billboards. Anyway, thanks for watching. Go see the movie and I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.